Welcome back. We are here looking at the cryptocurrency market. This is going to be my daily forecast for Monday, August 23rd, 2021. If you like to support the channel, you want to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos. And we'll start by looking at Bitcoin. And as you can see, we are trading at the 48K at this point. We got really close to 50K. And that should be where we'll find the... 56 Fibonacci retracement right around this area here, 51, 51K or 50K in that area. So breaking above here, then we are most likely going back to the all time highs. Get rejected here if the 20 exponential does not cross the 200 moving average and just turns around, then we could see this market tumble back to the downside. There is, there is, uh, well, quite fairly excited. Uh, it has been bouncing off the 20 exponential. So we saw it here, bounce, bounce. If we fall back and bounce again from the 20 exponential, then it's very likely that we'll just continue higher. Otherwise, break below here, and then we could drop all the way back to the very bottom. MACD at this point is flat, stochastic is bearish, and the RSI is bearish as well. So let's look at Ethereum. So Ethereum has a pullback trading at 3,125. MACD has crossed the signal line, so is the stochastic. So momentum is changing to the downside. And the same thing goes for this market. It kind of ran into the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement right here, three times tested it and then got rejected. We are also bouncing off the 20 exponential. So we could see this market drop below the middle of the bullish band that will break all the way down to 2,766 and uh, probably down to the 50 moving average. Uh, but if Bitcoin starts to fall apart, then this will most likely continue also fall apart. But this is a very normal move for, for any market that has a massive rally, falls apart, rallies towards the 50 or the 61 Fibonacci retracement and then goes back towards the very bottom. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens in the next few weeks when or not we break the 20 exponential and the 50 and the 200, then we could drop all the way down back towards uh, 1700. MACD, as I said, is bearish, stochastic is bearish, and so is the RSI. So hope you find this helpful. You want to support your channel by subscribing, hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos. And good luck and thank you very much.